Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Uh, today's video is a little bit different. Uh, we're going to be starting a series, a three-part uh, video series where we go over the flight planning, the autopilot system, and how to set up an RNAV or ILS approach or visual approach to any runway airport in the sim with the PC-12 NGX. This is a popular aircraft that's used in career mode um, in the sim and for charter and for cargo so being able to set up an alternative flight plan so you can then set up RNAV and the autopilot system accordingly uh, is going to be very helpful so we're just going to dive into it it's just going to be a simple 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 like three minute video um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is navigate over in between these two panels to the middle panel and you're going to want to just just switch this to route it doesn't really matter but for me i just like to have it on route uh you'll see down here we have flight plan altitude and speed fuel and weight so fuel and weight doesn't really matter that's if you're going to want to add more fuel to your aircraft or change the weight and balance of your calculations all uh speed how fast in our cruise basically you could just set all this and then flight plan which is what we want so uh we're starting at tampa so we have our origin already set. If the origin isn't there, uh, when you first start up the airplane, it might not be there when you're on the ramp. So you'll just click on origin and you'll just come down here. So for my case, it's Tampa. So we'll do KTPA. We'll enter, then it'll ask for our destination. So we'll wanna, for me, I'm just gonna do KJAX because that's where I wanna go. So we'll hit enter. So now you can see up here that it says insert. So you just want to hit insert. Then it's going to show a preview of our flight plan. Uh, here you can't really do much. You can just see, okay, 23 heading, um, the airport, uh, where we just were at, and everything like that. You'll just hit activate. And then you'll wait for this to turn green, which it has. So that means that our flight plan is now activated. And if you always want to change it, so let's say you actually did the wrong one, you want to change it, you can just come back to origin down here. Uh, KTPA, enter, and then let's say we accidentally put the wrong one and we want to do, uh, we want to do Zephyr Hills, KZPH. So it's just, oops. Basically the same process here, then you'll just hit insert, activate, and it'll switch it over to that one. So that's basically very simple with that. Very simple way to add a flight plan. Um, if you have any questions and you can't figure it out or the screen's not showing for you, uh, just let me know in the comments below and I will try to help you with that. The next video is just gonna be using the autopilot system inside this aircraft. So yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.